Hi everyone, it's your girl Jess with a mess who doesn't settle for less, only wants the best and no stress, honey. So, as you can probably tell, um, firstly, I'm sitting in a car, just waiting for my mom. Um, she went into checkers. I just came back from my part of doing the errands and initially this video was supposed to be done at home but because we're still out on the streets um i thought i might as well um so this is really a just a check-in video um and something that's been on my mind since i mean i didn't post the last week and i remember telling you guys that i would be very like easy on myself and not put pressure on myself to like post every week and you know but post when i can and if i feel like the content is right so if you guys have noticed my baby sister's been like on the channel like a lot in almost every video and that's mostly because i'm literally with her all the time now and as well as like she's so much fun guys you guys have seen for yourselves like she's so much fun and she honestly makes it easier for me because she's always like so excited and so ready she's like okay what's the theme for the next video you know um so that's mostly why she's been on this journey with me um but also um she helps like in terms of excuse me in terms of helping me cope because i tend to put a lot of pressure on myself with things especially when i i want to succeed i always want to succeed in everything that i do um i always want to make sure that i've put my best foot forward and most of my friends can attest to that um and literally anything that i put my mind to i i can do like it will happen because i want it to happen and because i'll do anything to make it happen you know I, I i just work like that so for me youtube is that one platform that is very unpredictable because some days you'll have followers and then some days um people i mean subscribers sorry and then some days you know it's just it's not so great and you feel like your channel is just not doing so well so um, she really helps on that front but also during lockdown I've come to learn a lot of things about myself is that I'm, I'm very very hard on myself and that's something um, that needs to change and not needs to change in the sense that um, I should stop being hard on myself and just relax all the time but I, I, I need to understand that I'm a human like I'm human and I have feelings I I tend to forget sometimes that actually like sis you you have feelings like it's okay if you don't like how things are happening right now in your life and so on and so forth um so this check-in is really for me but also for you guys um I saw a video done by one of my friends on um instagram i won't mention her name but the first thing she said was like we see so many videos of people saying like if you're watching this it means i'm already dead or i'm already gone and like that that really hit home for me because i i i know i've i've been at that point sometimes where i'm just like I don't know what I'm doing I just I just want to sleep the whole day or oh, I'm just tired and I'm just sad I'm and I'm sad a lot of the time and I don't know I genuinely don't know I don't know why I don't know where it comes from like I could I could never tell you like I'm sad because the dog from next door was barking so loud I didn't sleep all night you know like sometimes I'm just sad and these days they happen and I have come to realize that it's really just about me but it's really just about me kind of getting to um, 
a place where I understand that it's okay but also that I need people I need people we all do like we were created to need people love yourself as you love others we need people because people people help you sometimes you don't realize how how bad you're feeling in a moment until someone makes you laugh or someone makes you smile like we don't realize it at all i know that um so i i, I went to after right and um a lot of my friends would be like yo chess you know everyone and the funny thing is i don't like i don't necessarily know everyone but Sometimes you'll pass someone in the hallway and you can just tell that, you know what, this person is not okay. And if you just smile and you say, hey, how are you? You're good. Okay, cool. And then it just becomes a thing where that person knows that if they see you, they, they just know that, you know what, that seems like a safe space, you know. And in saying all of this, I realize that I haven't given myself that safe space in terms of allowing other people to make me feel happy i've always like wanted to make myself happy like i know how to make myself happy i know how to make myself laugh i know how like i can crack up any time you know but i haven't like relied on people to make like make me happy make me so and so make me wada 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 and that's it's it's not great because like i was saying before we do need people um there was um i was talking to my friend um his name is gamo i was i've been talking to him for like the past two days we firstly i i knew from the moment that he texted me that this person misses me i could just tell and and then when he mentioned it i was like I knew it. I miss me too sometimes, you know. I have this thing where like I deflect. I, I really deflect and um I can't believe I've been speaking so long. I don't know how this is happening, but I think it's also because I want to talk about this, but it's fine. Um and then I was actually like, you know what? I, I really miss you. Like I, I miss you too, my friend. Like we we need to sit we need to chill we need to oh we need to talk like and he and i we talk like maybe once every week and we'll talk for like hours on the phone but it's just never the same and i realized that i you know what i do have people and i just need to allow myself to allow them to be friends you know um it's, it's just really hard it's just really hard sometimes i'm so sorry that glare is not just trying to there's, there was an ugly glare coming from that side okay that's better um so i think i've kind of like gone on a tangent and stuff but really um guys check in with yourselves check in with your friends check in with your family check in with everyone um, I felt really bad this week because um, like once a week, once or twice a week, I'll I'll phone my niece Kai, and this week like I don't call her until yesterday, where I was just kind of coming back to myself, um, and I just felt so bad because I know that after I call her, I feel so good, like I feel so great. I'm like, you know what? Let's go. I'm ready for the world, you know so um i just i really think it's important guys to just check in with yourself if you know you've been having like a bad couple of days just process that like by yourself and kind of just see the things that make you happy the things you're grateful for in your life um and honestly these are just things that have worked for me um i think sometimes we forget like we forget about those things that make us happy we forget about the good things going on in life and they might not be happening in our lives necessarily but you know they are good things that are happening and i'm i just think listen
happen guys if we just if we just sit down and breathe and just be grateful to just be here you know to just be able to be I I think everything would just be awesome well not awesome but you know bearable um so this is a plea from me to you guys to check in with yourselves check in with your family members check in with your friends even those people that you think are acquaintances they might hold you highly in high regard you know in their lives so just check in and if anyone needs like someone to listen to them or you need a rant like that's cool you know what come at me like i will listen i have no problem listening i just have a problem with voice notes so if your voice notes can be like 24 minutes just break it up because the minute i see a voice note that says five minutes i'm just all sorry <laughs> but i will listen I'll, I'll complain but i'll listen um and yeah i hope you guys have an awesome 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 week ahead um next week might be another chilled video might be another chilled video i'll see i'll see as the week goes how i'm feeling really but um thank you so much for watching this video it means the world that i can even you know talk like this <laughs> gosh <laughs> but yeah thank you so much um also yeah this is my outfit i really like how i look today i like brown i think it looks really nice on my skin okay that's a different thing but yeah thank you so much for watching thank you all it's your girl just with the mess who doesn't settle for less only wants the best with no stress honey <laughs> ah gosh i love you guys this actually, you know what, this is my safe space. This is my safe space.